today i will share two genius masking tricks in canva that will help convert this feather into designs like this so let's start with it so first i will go to chat gpt and for your help i have already created the prompt so i don't take much of your time so i just wrote here help me generate an image prompt for artistic look feather image okay and after clicking on submit here is the prompt that i chat gpt generated for me and i have visited canva ai and here i clicked on create an image and i have kept the canva size as 1 is to 1 okay and after that canva has created me this four feather images which is quite cool and you can use it for any of your designs you want so using these designs i will show you how to make the masking effect in canva with two ways so let's start with it so i will go to home and canva and here i will click on instagram post square format okay so let's start with the first effect i will go to uploads and as you can see here the feathered image i have already uploaded and these are two of the images so i will show you where from i got these two images so the first one is in free peak and you, you just need to write artistic jungle with and it will generate you uh, ai images and make sure you are using this free so that you can download it for free and click on ai generated if you uh, are not getting this ai generated images okay so i will have scrolled it and as you can see there are many images and i am using this image for one design and another one i am using this one okay so this one i have wrote the search as artistic jungle with deer so i have got this image so these are the two images which i have been using and if you want the prompt for this artistic feather please let me know in the comments so that i can just give you the prompt in the description please let me know okay so first i will bring this artistic feather and just cover it here and just keep it uh, slightly cropped because we want to generate the edit effect so we'll go to edit and here i will scroll down to find duotone go to custom and make sure both the highlights and shadows are in black color so the proper black color is 6 times 0 and use the same here also okay so the work is done now we use bg remover so i have got the feather image and now i will just click on share and click on download to download this png image okay so click on download and to make the this image fit in the frame so i will just make it slightly bigger and use it here and check the transparency if it is working fine or not so let's go slightly here and place it in the middle so the design looks good and this is the design and after that just increase the transparency and just cut the image paste it in the second page and again download it make sure it is in png and click on current page download so when the downloading is done click on add page and add both the designs you just downloaded okay so as you can see the images are here okay and just scroll down to apps and here write blend and use the first app which is blend image and select the bottom layer as the dear one 
and use the top layer as the feather one and as you can see if you clip the blend mode as screen and your design is created just add page and add to design here and your design is ready okay so step one or the first way is done so let me show you the second way which is i will bring the feather again here and use the bg remover and click on edit and make sure this time you use duotone and both the colors to white okay and go to elements click on shape and just cover the feather with this shape just check if it is covering or not so it is covering now change the color to yellow okay and when it is done now click on share download and make sure you download only this current page and click on download and just add page and add the image which you just downloaded and use bg remover so let's change the background and see if the feather color is changed or not so this is done now i will change it again to white okay so when it is working fine now let's upload the tiger image here and right click layer send to back and as you can see the tiger image is visible but we have to just crop down to make the effect more prominent okay so let's bring it right here and as you can see our image is done now let's click ctrl plus a in the keyboard to select both the layers and make it bigger so our design is ready but as you can see the background is coming to be yellow so to change that i will again click on edit go to duotone and change the custom color to white or any color you want you can do that so as you can see you can just change to any color but if you want to just remove the background which is yellow or this time is white you can just download this image and again remove the background to remove the whole of the background and keep just the feather so hope you like this tutorial and learned both the ways to make this masking effect and please subscribe to the channel for more videos and tutorials like this thank you